some of the most uh, innovative, progressive, uh, forward-thinking companies are really embracing doing things in an unconventional way, at least part of the time. Um, I shared this on a, a LinkedIn post or maybe in my LinkedIn newsletter that uh, Google, for many years now, has a concept that they call 20% time. And, uh, and 3M company has, um, they call it 15% something. But the notion of both of these is the same in, in that they want people to do their job that they've been hired to do in the way that Google or 3M wants them to do it 80% of the time, or in 3M's case, it's 85%. And then the other percent, they can work on anything that they want in any way that they want and utilize any resources that they want. And I, I read this article. Um, it was, I forget who they were interviewing from Google. It was like the chief product development officer, or some C-level guy. And he said that 90% or better of their innovations come from that 20% time. And, you know, it's people just, people are creative, they're imaginative, they're resourceful um, if you give them some freedom. And um, and some people are going to use a screw off, but whatever, you know, who cares? What, what you really care about is the results. And sometimes it's you got to get out of your conventional ways of doing things and conventional ways of thinking in order to produce different, better ideas. And so that's why I believe that companies that are smaller than Google and 3M are going to be very uh, receptive to embracing some new concept uh, to to do stuff that, to help them be more competitive in the marketplace. So that's why I think uh, the, the things that we're doing are, I mean, we're just, uh, even though we've been doing it for quite some time, I think we're it's in the infancy on, on what it's going to be. And, uh,